man, I don't know anyone that doesn't have a donut, a muffin, something that that's left over. It's all hard, right? You're kind of like, oh man, I forgot about this bad boy. So to do this, that one egg, right? Make sure it's not the egg we do, you know, when you get ojo and get the rub it. So we get the egg, put it in here. Oh, a big thing is that people, for some reason, think if you hit it in a corner, right? That's the best way to crack an egg? Nah. Cause wait, when you do that, it cracks the yolk. You do something flat on a flat surface, you're golden. So that, and then a little bit of, a little bit of milk. Just like that. And then you just whisk it. And then like with this, you get vanilla if you want to, right? Everyone's grandmother always brings that big thing of vanilla from Mexico. You can always add a little bit of that into it. You know, whatever you use is gonna impart that flavor, right? So if you use like a blueberry muffin, it's gonna impart that blueberry muffin, right? So whatever you use is gonna be that flavor. I like using the donuts from Krispy Kreme, but I always feel like you get diabetic with just one of those damn things. So then we have this mixture, right? That's here. And then what I like to do is do a little cinnamon in it. A lot of cinnamon. Okay, and then we cut these into pieces. We like big dudes, come into big dudes, you like little dudes. This is really cool too, like if, you know, you go, you go to, the, to the store and they always have that day old one. It's like a quarter for them or whatever. And you can make a lot of this. And this is the easy way. Something you can just do, you know, when you're watching TV, you're binge watching something. You're kind of like, oh man, what am I gonna eat? Okay, so when you do this, you just gotta make sure that the bread soaks up a lot of this liquid. You could do this overnight. You could do this for a couple of hours if you want to. You know, I have no patience though. You let it soak in this liquid. You always add nuts and berries to it. You know, but I think this is something that's fast, something that you're kind of like, oh man. Or something that you're like, oh man, you have a sweet tooth and you're kind of like, man, I wish I had a donut right now, right? But you're like, damn, all I have is that stupid pan de dulce. So then you try to get it, yeah. So like right now you see like the bread kind of soaked up a lot of that liquid, right? So you have all this craziness. My brother likes to eat it raw like that. It's weird, but hey, each their own, my friend. So then we get this cup. You have to use this one, splashing through the snow. If you don't have this cup, it's not gonna work. I'm just playing. You're, just make sure your cup is microwavable and you'll be good. So then this guy, we're gonna put in as much as we can. We push it all down to the bottom, right? Push it, push it, push it, right? The cool thing is that we throw in the microwave and it's literally about like a minute and a half. Make sure you've used the microwave before to know how to use it. Okay, so this is the way I do it. So what I do is I just turn it as high as I can and I just watch it. All right, I've never used this, hopefully it works. So what I do is I get real close to it and I just watch it and once it starts to expand, it's done, right? So we're looking, make sure it's expanding. My biggest fear is that the cup's not microwavable and it shoots through the thing and then gets your face. Okay. So now that it's, 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 it's expanded, right? So we put caramel on, on the top like this, right? Then whipped cream. Right? And you can do anything you want. You know, it doesn't necessarily have to be like that. You know, you can make a big thing, put it in the oven, and do it the traditional way. You know, my thing is this, is that when I'm at home, I don't like to cook a lot. I don't want to be the easiest way to do it. I don't want to wash the dishes because then my wife's all like, who did this? You know, I can't blame anybody, it's just me. So it's one of those things where like, if I could just use one damn thing and get away with it, I'm good. You know, and then usually like, I'll eat it and I'll go sneak away where she can't see me, like I'll be outside, you know? And then this way she can, you know, she make me count stupid calories. Dumbest things. <laughs> 